Hey guys, Chris here, Starlink News, uh, back with another FAQ question. Uh, I'm just going to go in depth with the question because it's too jumbled to try and go through every single one with the answer. So today we're focusing on, I'm having issues with my initial setup and getting online for the first time with my Starlink. Um, number one, make sure everything is plugged in correctly. That means cables from your Starlink and Wi-Fi router should both be plugged into the power supply and the power supply should be plugged into the uh, in indoor grounded three pin AC outlet that receives power. So that's what you need to have it plugged into. Uh, match your colors, black cable to black port, white cable to white port. Um, when correctly connected and plugged in, you should see both lights on the power supply turn solid white. Uh, within 60 seconds of powering on, your Starlink should automatically level itself. So again, don't try and tilt the dish. It's got a mechanical motor in it and you, you'll probably break it. And I don't think they warranty that. Uh, from here, your Starlink will search for satellites overhead. And once it makes initial connection to the Starlink constellation, that typically takes 15 to 30 minutes, your Starlink will tilt itself. So again, don't tilt it, let it do its own thing. You can now connect uh, to the name on the back of the Starlink Wi-Fi router. As stated before, you can't take this thing to your neighbors or to like uh, your other work location. It's, it's to the address that's specified on the router. Um, once the system has uh, successfully established an internet connection with the, uh, the Wi-Fi router, light will turn solid white, like I said. You're now connected to the network. Um, now, if you're still not able to get online, they have a troubleshooting section of, um, of the app that I have. It's, uh, this is what it says. If still not online, troubleshoot as follows. Number one, check Wi-Fi router light. If it's blinking white, you're receiving a, a software update or waiting for software update, or it's booting up. So flashing white light, you're, you're, not, totally, uh, you're not totally screwed. And hope, like, it should turn solid white once the updates are, are complete and once your, um, your booting up has completed. If you got the red light, then it's not connected. Check, um, check your Starlink field of view because you may be experiencing obstructions uh, in front of the dish. Um, and you can use the Starlink app to do that. It's got a checking for obstruction um, little icon on it. And you just push that and it'll give you a search around your dish. Um, I'll put everything up above my shoulder uh, throughout the video to, if you guys want to pause it and read it, it's pretty much, I've, I've taken verbatim right from what I have on my app. So um, hopefully it helps out. Uh, I'll be back with another one shortly to uh, tick off another question in the boxes. All right, have a good day guys and I'll talk to you again soon.